Hello traders, welcome to One Best Trade YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to explain how to take a pullback trade in DAN and also I'm going to explain the logic behind this trade. Come, let's explore. The first thing all you need to do is identify opportunity and then define your entry and also target and stop loss. Then keep a cursor, press the plus button and then your order got placed that is a super order, a limit order. So now you need to select a, a target tab and drag and drop to the target level and then select the stop loss and drag and drop to the stop loss level. Now your limit order is set. Let's wait the price to retrace. The price is coming towards our entry line. Order got executed. Let's see that how price action is going to pan out. So Nifty in the cash chart uh, testing the broken support that is a flip zone very very important are they going to reject from there in the premium chart the market created a drop base rally within the drop base rally there is a small rally base rally that is where order got picked up and also our stop loss is just below that rally base rally base let's see that how the price action is going to pan out and also and in the current candle is it going to be a, a green candle in the premium the great sign if it is a and a red candle in the cash chart that is a going to be a good sign for this trade it is a creating a doji candle in the premium chart it is a long leg doji if a doji high breaks that's a great sign in the cash chart there is a doji if a doji low breaks that's a great sign for this trade yes market is slowly breaking the long leg doji high great sign in the cash chart market is also creating a lower low formation one more low that is also happened to be pdl great sign so price is very close to our target couple of points away yes our target is done come let's explore what is the logic behind this trade okay, before getting into logic uh, important notes regarding super orders in case if you close manually this order uh, before hitting the stop loss or a target then you need to close target orders and stop loss order manually okay if uh, target hits automatically stop loss order get cancelled if a stop loss hit automatically target order get cancelled but if you exit before target or a stop loss then you need to manually close stop loss and also target order please note this so now let me give you the logic behind this trade. The market opened with a gap down and then sharply recovered towards a previous day supply zone. Very, very important supply zone where market started giving a, a rejection. And from there, market created a, a lower low formation. Market broken the first important support that is a rally base rally. That was a confirmation to go short. So market given a small pullback towards the flip zone and from there we got excellent opportunity to go short with a precise stop loss that is how we got a excellent target so if you want to master in price action trading we do have a courses for more information check the description and send me a whatsapp message if you have a doubts and we'll catch up in the next video thank you very much